What's up guys, got some more Infinite Warfare for you today. Figured I would give this game a second impression now that I've put in considerably more time since my original video. I've played the beta for probably 25 to 30 hours at this point, and I've gotten pretty good at it. I'm, I've been manually tracking my stats just via pen and paper, and I'm at a, uh, a 3.5 KD, like a little bit below a 3.5 KD. Uh, on probably my last uh, 25, 30 games that I've been writing them down for. Uh, so I've gotten much better at the game. Uh, but the problem is, is that I have gotten better at the game because I've figured out how to exploit these shitty maps. That is my biggest issue with this game, is the maps. And that was my biggest issue on my original First Impressions video, and it doesn't seem like that's really going to change outside of the fact that I figured out how the spawns work, kind of, and I figured out little power spots and just things that develop due to bad map design. You know, I figured out how little, little things, right? But the thing, the biggest issue I have with this game has got to be the randomness of it. And that was what I said in my first video, and I'm going to just re-up that opinion here again. Uh, even with more played time, even with me being considerably better at the game, the randomness is still there, which is why I find this 31-0 game so impressive, because it's fucking hard to go an entire game without getting bullshitted on at least a few times, even as a good player. Uh, even watching the, the really, really good, like the pro players play on Twitch, they get shot in the back, they get shot... Um, in the side, because there's just so many different places that people can come from that you you, you can't avoid it. You know, you, you check a corner, and you check another corner, and then the third corner you didn't check because you just don't have time to check every single corner all the time is where you get shot from, or some guy comes around the corner that you just checked because the maps are so tiny and chaotic and uh, you can't see more than five feet in front of you. It just leads to lots of random deaths, and that is not fun. And... You might be saying, well, you know, you're, you're, you're a three and a half KD player. Like, I mean, come on, you're going to die some, right? No, that's not why I play COD. I play COD to go on these fucking giant 75 and 0 kill streaks. And if I die, I want that death that ended my adrenaline rush of being on a giant kill streak to at least be warranted. Uh, but a lot of times it's to bad map design. Really? You just die because you got unlucky because some guy spawned right there and the game just decided, fuck you, you need to die. That's that's how a lot of deaths are in this game. And sometimes you do lose gun on gun, but a lot of those gun on gun deaths, at least if you're a good player, come down to latency. And the time to kill is so quick in this game that if some guy has a slight ping advantage on you, that you're just, you're just dead because the time to kill is so fast, the guns have so little recoil, and there's so little outplay potential due to the low recoil and due to the fast time to kill that you being at a slight ping advantage is almost unrecoverable so that blows it really sucks to die in cod a game that i pub stomp in to that and i know this sounds like first world problems but uh that's why i play cod that's that's i'm a cod fan i want to enjoy cod it's a great game for what i want it to be when it's good i like games like cod is a great game for me because i can just get on it shit on some noobs go on some big kill streaks get my AC-130 and, and go to town, right? That's, that's fun. I, I've always liked that about COD, you know, Black Ops 1, get the dogs, get the chopper gunner, cue the music, and just slay nerds, man. It's fun, right? But they've taken that away. The kill streaks in this game suck shit. The only one that's worth a fuck is the Warden. And the Warden is... The Warden's okay. I'll be honest. I'm okay with the Warden. That's fine. But the other ones, the higher kill streaks, the Thor and the uh, RC robot guy is dog shit. The uh, remote control drone thing sucks shit. Uh, that thing, that needs to be a chopper gunner. That needs to be an AC-130. What happened to those kill streaks? I want those kill streaks back. I want. I want the fucking AC-130 back. Why did they take the most fun kill streak out of in COD and COD history out of the games completely? I have no idea. Um, so that sucks, dude. The kill streaks blow dick. This game literally seems like a complete downgrade from Black Ops 3 in every single way. If you were to tell me that the release cycle went um, 
Advanced Warfare, Infinite Warfare, Black Ops 3, I would believe you because th that makes sense. Black Ops 3 is better than this game in every single way. I can't, I've, I've played this game for what, 30 hours and I can't tell you one thing this game did better than Black Ops 3. The maps in Black Ops 3 are infinitely better. The kill streaks significantly better. The, the game features are better. Uh, the camos, the guns, dude, the camos, the game just feels cheap. And I don't particularly care about camos, but the camos in this game are so lazy. This game just feels really fucking lazy. And they spent three years making this thing. And some of the camos are solid, like, pink. Like, that's a camo. And most of them just look like shit compared to the Black Ops 3 ones. Like, Black Ops 3 had this whole thing where you could create your own gun camo and make your own emblems. And all that shit is, is gone. Like, what the fuck happened? Um, I, I don't, I don't know, man. It really does just seem like a downgrade in every way possible. And, uh, I know, I know I made this, I know I was talking shit about the game in my first impressions video, and this is my second impressions, but the verdict stands. The game feels lazy. That's my, that's my, my verdict, dude. A lot about this game just feels, it feels really lazy. And, uh, it's a slap in the face to, to people that, Used to like COD for what it was. Um, I won't be buying it, I don't think, anyway. Uh, I'll be playing some Battlefield 1, some Titanfall 2, hopefully, and Overwatch. And I'm a, I'm a COD fan, man. It hurts me to say that I'm probably not going to buy this game. And I'm good at it. I mean, I'm not as good at it as, as I was at other CODs, but for considering the randomness, I feel like I'm pretty good at it. So, what do you guys think? Um, I'm kind of let down.